G'day guys, welcome back to the channel again. Uh, I'm onto another new map after the one we did yesterday. This one is updated on the 3rd of the 3rd. 20 locations, countries without access to the sea. I'm not sure we may get some unofficial coverage here possibly, but maybe not. Uh, only one person's played it, so one of us will probably end up on this leaderboard, hopefully, if we can beat 8,334. Uh, we'll leave it on three minutes and moving, panning, zooming. And let's get in there and see what we get. If you want to play along, this link here will be down in the description. Click on that and you'll get the same five rounds I'm about to get right now. Okay. Countries without access to the sea. You've got to keep that in mind. What could this be? And that's all we can move, is it? Slovakia. I don't know where, though. Wagner. Service Centrum. Hmm. 12 Kosic, Slovakia. Let's just go for a look and see. Maybe we're in there, Kosic. Possibly. So anything else on there we can help? Teslov two o four o twelve. Teslova. Is it a town around it, or what is that? I'm not even sure. Um, do we have numbers there? Eight. Just over two. Getting a bit closer, maybe. sure could be there do you know what? I'm just gonna go for that oh it was I thought it might be down near the train tracks somewhere too wasn't exactly sure though but yeah there we were there's Wagner we saw that too I should have probably taken a bit more time and looked along the train line may have spotted it but 1.9 k's away 4,995 points. Okay. So it's kind of like I thought we were going to get some photospheres here. Where could this be? All the palm trees and stuff makes you think it's near the coast, which is exactly what this map isn't. Any language you can see? Not really. Looks like it's a school or something, maybe like that. But no idea where to even guess here. It looks so coastal though. <laughs> um, God, where could that be? Africa, maybe? Zimbabwe? Um, let me check the sun, kind of. Sun seems to be hmm, 
I'm just in the east. Not really helping. Yeah, it's from southeast to northeast, sort of. Can we use the shadows on the ground, maybe? Okay, there's a line off that palm tree. Okay, the sun might be more in the south, so we might be in the north. 50 seconds left. Um, these all have access to the coast. I think, um, I don't know, maybe Africa, I suppose. We'll try Uganda. I can't think of anything else. It's right on the equator, which kind of makes sense with the sun, but I'm not sure really. Let's just go for that. Okay, I should have gone Zimbabwe, which was my first thought. It would have been a bit closer. It was actually Zambia. Probably would have gone Harare. At least we got a few points though, 1,797. There we go again. We can move here, which is good. And we're back in Europe, so that could help as well. Skopje, tourist map. That is, where is that? Down here somewhere, yeah. North Macedonia. That's very helpful. Uh, so we have a big stadium to the northwest. There's a river down there as well. Let's see if we can spot the stadium. It's right next to the river. Park Aerodome. Don't think it's that. The stadium is on the northwest. Maybe we're here. There's a big stadium there, Tosh Proeski Arena. We're looking northwest. We could be there somewhere. Even further back here. How far away does it look? Mm, we're pretty close to it, I think. Let's keep looking along and see if there's another stadium somewhere. A1 Arena Sports Centre. 38 seconds. Okay, it's heading out of town. I think we might leave it there. Yeah, that kind of, there's one there too, but it doesn't kind of add up as much as this. So I don't know. Mm. Yeah, we got it. Well, close to one point off we lost. Should have gone in the car park there. 223 meters away. Okay. That's the Nepal flag, isn't it? Kathmandu. 
some pretty good clues. I might just start looking for that, I think. <coughs> There's Katmandu. Um, Kulishwa. Does that show up here anywhere? Zoom in a bit more, maybe. Coolest war it is, yeah, okay. Um, I just noticed the WOR and a couple of words around, so I thought, yeah, I don't know where this will be, but Paramount EM. Kuleshwa. Kuleshwa. I suppose we'll just scan and try and see it somewhere. What was the name of the school? Paramount. Can't see it. Looks like there's lots of schools though. All the embassies along there. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to find this. Ten seconds left. Okay, oh, there it is. I must have gone past that. Damn it. Coolish War. There's the school. It was definitely findable, that was. I just couldn't spot it then. We're 5.2 k's away. Round five. Um. don't know where this is, but I feel like this, I feel like this location was one, one of um, Geo Wizards videos a while back, but he was doing a no moving challenge. That looks like a United States flag there. Hmm, Sable. Yeah, I've got a feeling this was definitely on one of his videos. I don't think he was doing countries without access to the sea, but it could have been, but it was just like a no move map he was doing a while back. Augmentation, maybe something. No idea. Let's have a look. I feel like it's up here somewhere. Mm. 
So Iraq actually has access to the sea just there. Could be Jordan. Maybe it's here somewhere like Sudan, not Sudan, Chad. We've all got access to the sea. We can rule all of them out. Could be like South Sudan, Juba, Wa'u. I honestly don't know if it's even that country. Um, Afghanistan, probably not. Chad, Sudan, it's got access to the sea. Maybe Niger. I'll go for that. Very small amount of confidence though, but I'll go for it. Let's see what happens. Ooh. There's actually chat. I should have plunked between Sudan and Niger. Yeah, if someone remembers that location, if you saw his video, I'm pretty sure that's where that exact location he had. And he even might have found it, I think. He spent a long time looking for all the different ones. Uh, that's the end of it anyway. It ended up with 19,023 points. Some fairly easy rounds there, but also the couple in Africa. Pretty difficult. Almost nothing to go off really on some of them. But the other three were fairly easy. So a good mix of places. Not a bad map. I like that one. Um, we'll just go off to another random map again next. Um, leave a like if you've enjoyed this one. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'm putting videos up pretty much every day. And I'll catch you all tomorrow. Cheers.